frames what are the frames of i2c protocol so that if you are understand the frames of i2c protocol yes you can come to know how it works so we'll have a quick glance on i2c protocol and in this uh, tutorial i'm not i'm not only going to tell you uh, what and how i'll just make you immediately to uh, to make you remember how the frames works so the frame is here i have start with uh, without name i have given so that you can easily remember here i will start with green green is a start bit has the traffic rules how it is so green is start so start start of bit and red is a end of bit that is stop of bit and yellow is a acknowledgement so whenever the data receives it will acknowledge the slave used to acknowledges the master okay then apart from that we have four more fields the the green the you know the brown color light brown color is a slave address to which slave it has to be and white color is a just uh, you can remember the piece of paper you can uh, you, you can read or write something in a white paper so i have made that field as a white and uh, black is a data what data you used to uh, write it should not explicit to the outside world that is a black and uh, purple there is a light blue is nothing but the register or address so now i guess it is easy to remember for you so green is simple start ready stop yellow is a acknowledgement as per the traffic rules then black is a data it should not explicit and white is a paper that uh, you can read or write any address then brown is a slave okay so slave address which slave as we know we have used previously three slaves so any of the slaves and finally the blue is register so that's it i guess you are a bit you may feel a bit difficult to uh, remember the blue but uh, that is the only thing you, ha you have to remember so for the register it's a register address so these are all the frames so we'll see here once again so as, as i said green is a start bit 